This is gyroscopic motion. Not only are you throwing the boomerang forward, but it's mm -hmm. spinning, which gives it tremendous stability and wants it to keep going in that direction, just like a gyroscope. Would. Well, that doesn't explain why it wants to come around and come back. Ah, uh, but there's the lift involved. The lift. Yeah, now each wing, as it comes over the top here, is generating more lift than when it's going back on the bottom because of this forward motion. Mm -hmm. So the wind's going over at a higher rate of speed. So you have the lift making it want to go like that, but it can't go like that because it has a gyroscopic stability keeping it going like that. I see. So, so when you add the two together, you get that's a turn. When, that's when you like get it that. to turn around. Hmm. And as it loses the force from your throw, mm -hmm. that layover takes more effect and it goes into a final hover like that. I see. That's very, very interesting. Now we have a uh, little tape we can show of boomerang in motion. Now here it is being launched and it's almost a vertical throw but you can see it's turning. Yeah. It's, not, it's not falling down, it's not going straight. And it's rising up slightly. You and can see the lift too. There's the lift and it's coming, into, coming around the turn. You'll see the spin still on it, very strong, and you can see it's starting to lay down. And you can see there how fast the yes. tips are spinning. Yes, blurred on the tips, but the center is still quite well, visible. Well, that's, that's the gyroscopic forces there. It's the spin. Is, can anybody make a boomerang like the kind you just thrown over there? Well, that's a little harder, but we can start with some basic ones here. Okay, what have you got? Well, I have one out of a pizza box. <laughs> it really, it really is a pizza box. Yet this doesn't have the kind of wing shape that, the, that your boomerang has. How is it able to fly? Well, it really doesn't need it. Remember we talked about positive angle of attack. Right. So this has that, so it's creating lift off of that and it's so light it doesn't need the full airfoil. You have one here made out of uh, balsa wood. Right. You also have one here that's, uh, look at this, made out of rulers. I guess you could say this is the boomerang against which all others would be measured. <laughs> you might say it, I won't. <laughs> Thank you very much Eric for this lesson. You're it was welcome. very interesting. I hope I can return the favor someday. I'll be right back.